What is going on everybody? I am Serenzik Steel and thank you for spending a few minutes of your time with me here today. I really appreciate it. Just a quick announcement. Um, I am streaming regularly on Twitch. So link is up on top. Um, I, I stream all types of games there. A lot of the videos that you have been seeing recently on the channel have been from Twitch. I'm still working on a lot of videos that are going to be edited. The real Clone Wars series is still up and running. We're still, I'm still working on that. Just having a few issues, uh, with the pacing and the, and, and the, just the storyline of it because of issues that we had on the server. Um, still working on a couple more, uh, of just regular operations that look beautiful like like just a movie um also uh, gonna start a new uh series soon which is gonna be sins of a solar empire right now on the discord and the community discord will be down in the description and right now the poll on what faction i should be is overwhelmingly galactic republic so expect that series coming out really soon but again guys uh twitch tv serenzic steel i'm every day streaming uh sometimes multiple streams a day um and yeah really really uh, hope to see a lot of new names over there um and also it's if you're following following me on twitch tv uh you're already um along with my patreon and uh just regular regular tippers you're also um involved in in uh, you're already 50 percent done with with giveaways because how i usually do giveaways is you fo you follow my twitch and um you just put your twitch name in the in the comment section and and yeah that's how i do a lot of my or my giveaways so you're already ahead of a curve if you are following me on twitch so make sure you go ahead and do that so before we get into my computer specs and some of my hardware i want to congratulate laxar games for having his beautiful baby girl anya rose um i have absolutely no idea what it's like being a father but just best uh, best of luck to you um and again congratulations all right so now uh we're gonna get into my computer specs and we're gonna start off with the processor so starting off, we got the Core i7, 8700K, amazing processor. Um, before my previous computer, whenever I'd be streaming uh, and running Arma, uh, a very high processor or a CPU intensive game, um, it would be in the 90s and 95. Uh, with the Core i7, 8700, it's down to like 30s and 40s. It's outstanding. I couldn't have asked for a better thing. And 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 no, I'm not getting paid for Intel for this. Uh, but yeah, that that's it. Yeah, processor. Okay, cool. So next. And to hold that beast of a processor, we got the MSI Z370A Pro. Um, yeah, just it's an awesome processor. Uh, it works. Uh, I didn't mess up when I was uh, building the computer with it. So, I, again, I really have nothing else to say about the processor. But I, it does its job very well. All right, so for the cooler for the processor um, and all that, we have the Cooler Master Hyper uh, 212 Evo. Uh, when I was installing this onto the onto the CPU and also onto the motherboard, uh, first of all, the, the pace that you actually put on the CPU. Uh, I had absolutely no idea that's what you had to do. And by the way, this is my very first computer that I built and it was it was a blast um, blast building it. It was it was awesome. Um, but yeah, when I was installing the 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 cooler, I honestly thought I was going to break the motherboard and CPU in half. It, it was so stressful tightening it, making sure it's locked in place because again, I thought I was going to break the motherboard in half. Uh, but when I finally did it and I figured it out, um, it was it was I was very relieved. All right, guys. So for RAM, total four sticks. But let's start off with the first two sticks that I bought with the uh, with the computer. Um, it's uh, two sticks of four gigabytes. Um, when I finished building the computer, and I would be running programs like uh, OBS, uh, running, uh, uh, doing a stream, Arma three, and programs in the background, um, I quickly realized that I didn't have enough uh, RAM. Um, it would be up in the 85, 90 percent, and sometimes things would just completely crash, or my whole computer would crash. So I went ahead a few days later after realizing that I am, um, and these are just empty boxes, but I got two more G skill rip jaws, uh, two sticks of eight gigabytes. So between the four sticks, I got a total of 24 gigabytes. And now I'd be running all those, uh, all those programs. And I'm all the way down to like 45, uh, not even 35 to 40% of Ram running all these products in the background. It runs so smooth. It was an awesome buy, uh, but yeah, I got total four sticks of rip jaws. Two of those sticks are four gigabytes and the other two are eight gigabytes, totaling 24 gigs of Ram and it's awesome. And so continuing on memory, uh, first of all, I got the 128 gigabytes of SSD for the, the programs like OBS stream, my uh, just smaller things like that. Um, and for my games, uh, I have a one, ter uh, one terabyte hard drive. Um, so yeah, that, that's uh, my memory. Okay, so for my video card, I got the Gigabyte GeForce GTX 1070. It is, uh, this is a beast 
beast of a graphics card in hindsight i probably should have put in the extra 100 150 200 dollars um into a 1080 but a 1070 is absolutely a beast for those of you who've been watching my videos uh for a while um we'll definitely be able to tell that it's just a day and night difference between my frame rate and just the graphics quality from my let's just again keep it on armor 3 my armor 3 videos from low graphics frame rates going to be like under 20 but ever since i got the 1070 it, it's been incredible i'm running everything on not ultra because i still want i still want more frames is more important to me but i still want pretty good graphics so i have pretty much everything on high and it's it's running so smooth i got frames at 60 40 and those are good for arma and the amount of you know uh entities that are on screen or in the game at the same time just how intensive armor 3 is so again the uh, gtx 1070 is is a beast of a graphics card and powering it all is the seasonic m12 bronze edition uh 520 watt um i mean everything's turning on everything's working uh so i mean it, it does its job <laughs> All right, so um, I still have my keyboard box. So I'm gonna also show that to you. Um, it's a pretty simple gaming keyboard, LED backlit gaming keyboard. It's uh, pretty, it's really small. Um, it's efficient. Um, it doesn't have any of the hotkeys or anything like that, but it's not like I play like hockey intensive games anyways. Um, so it does its job. I mean, it has colors, three colors. You got red, blue, and purple, and then, you know, off. But yeah, um, and so that's it. And then for the mouse, it's um, just a, a regular mouse i mean it's like it's a gaming mouse but it's it could be better um it has a couple mouse buttons on there that i use for like um i mean they are useful honestly just having two hockeys um i don't think i'm the type of gamer that would efficiently use like 10 different hockeys on a mouse but the thing is i've never had one before so um maybe i don't know uh but yeah just simple hardware stuff like that but now i'm gonna switch you guys over to the um tower I'll show you guys the tower in a moment, but I just want to warn you that the audio quality is not going to be as good because my desk mic is not going anywhere. Um, also, I'm going to be free free holding the webcam, which I used to record. Um, and just just for perspective, um, the 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 last time I did an in real life video, um, the camera was this way. And the way I had it set up is I literally got an ironing board and two of my little brother's yearbooks to prop it up and and just you know record with that but here just bear with me it's going to be a little bit shaky the audio is not going to be as loud or clear so i'm gonna have to speak up a little bit more um and and yeah so just bear with me all right so for the tower we have the nzxt phantom uh full tower um in hindsight i mean the only thing i have uh issues about this tower is that it's just too damn big uh, but it's just one of those rookie mistakes when building your first computer um, I mean, it was very easy to put everything in there because there's a lot of space, obviously. But um, I, yeah, again, it's just a little bit too big. Um, but going, continuing on that, um, the the cooling uh, and the amount of fans that come in this uh, tower already is is outstanding. Um, very, very well cooled. You see the the fans there. Um, I have one installed here. I don't have one there. I will put a new one in there or another one in there soon. Um, and then also, so taking you over to the top fans, I mean, it has a blue, blue light, you know, obviously. Feels really good, um, it's very cool. Um, and also, when I have the fan control, and I'll show you that in a little bit, but before I get to that, if I lower down the fan, like the, the, the light gets lower, that's pretty cool. And so I'm gonna raise it up again. And there you go, I have a little fan control here. I got just the basic stuff you'll see for <clears throat> the computer. All right, and so for the fan control, we have the two, you know, the fans that are just uh, controlled right now. I've got two installed right now, and I have, I can install three more, which um, later, eventually I will, I will get uh, more fans. Like, there's another space here for one, a larger fan. I just need to get the, uh, I just need to get the size of the fans that are needed for this and everything, and I'll, I'll buy those over time. The way it looks here, I mean, just the other side of the Phantom. Um, again, there's no fan here, but you can, you can see inside for the, uh, hard drive trays here and then uh yeah it's just pretty basic stuff i decided to go with white because all the other computers that i've had in my life have been black so i was like you know what i'll, I'll try something new okay so that was my computer specs um i just want to thank there's so many people i want to thank for this if it honestly wasn't for you guys there's no way i would be able to uh, uh get a computer that was this good so some of the people i just want to thank walsh anthony fron hermes clayton death uh, some of my top tippers there thank you so much my patreons um everyone who subscribed to me on on, on twitch and and um I mean, everyone who's been watching the channel supporting me over these past few months. I mean, we're barely just getting started. We have so much potential here in this channel. Uh, this community, 
I mean, it's so it's 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 really it's a nice community. It's a lot of nice people. Uh, I really enjoy seeing uh, seeing people become friends, uh, doing playing community games together. I mean, it, it's awesome what we're doing here. Um, and then also to the Fire First Legion, I, it's so cool uh, being able to w with this channel, uh, being able to make uh, with the with the help of so many other people. Uh, create a huge community like the 501st and and um, just how well it's it's run and how much better it could still be run and we have people who in the unit who really care about it uh, and really care about uh, just making the entire environment there uh, just uh, uh, just a better place um, so again everybody that has supported the channel thank you so much thank you so much I can't I, I, I can't uh, show my appreciation more we're so close to 40,000 subscribers guys and don't worry there will be a giveaway there uh, initially I was gonna put it here but we're so close to have like we're a few hundred subscribers away from 40,000 subscribers and so I'll wait till then I'll wait a couple I'll, I'll wait a week and a half two weeks to get 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 those subscribers and then we'll, we'll have an awesome awesome giveaway uh, but uh, again uh, just thank you to everybody there uh, we're just getting started um, and again, link up on top, Twitch TV, Serensic Steel. Make sure you follow me there. I stream regularly there. A whole bunch of different games. Um, it's an awesome place, a, a very fun environment there. Um, and, and, and yeah, so make sure you follow me on Twitch. Uh, and you're already, for most of my uh, giveaways, you just give yourself a head start. For uh, my giveaway, uh, um, how to join them is... is follow me on twitch and then i'll check your name make sure you uh follow me and then that you posted a comment down in the giveaway video here on youtube uh but yeah give yourself a head start follow me on twitch and you're already ahead of the curb uh but so yeah that's gonna be pretty much it longest longest outro ever but again thank you so much guys and i'll see you guys in the next video and goodbye